Beacon controller opens up the valve to admit fresh water into the sump pit. During the test cycle, the status indicator for the primary pump flashes amber. Small system LEDs flash green to indicate the valve is open and fresh water is flowing into the pit. The rising water level triggers the primary pump's float switch to turn on the pump to pump water from the pit. A small system LED flashes green to indicate that the primary pump is running. When the primary pump begins to pump, the controller closes the valve to terminate water flow into the pit. When the water level in the pit falls to a lower level, the pump shuts off. When the primary pump shuts off, the controller turns the primary pump status indicator to solid green to indicate a successful test. What if the primary pump fails? The controller closes the valve when it detects that the primary pump failed to pump water from the pit. The controller also changes the primary pump status indicator from flashing amber to flashing red and sounds an alarm, indicating a failed test. Optionally, the PROACT 200 system reports successful and unsuccessful tests to designated recipients via its built-in Wi-Fi module. Testing the battery-powered backup pump The PROACT 200 system automatically tests the backup pump following each successful test of the primary pump by interrupting power to the primary pump and again admitting fresh water into the pit. Small system LEDs flash green to indicate the valve is open and fresh water is flowing into the pit. The water level in the pit rises and triggers the backup pump float switch to turn on the backup pump. The backup pump runs for a period of time to pump water from the pit. A small system LED flashes green to indicate that the backup pump is running. When the backup pump shuts down, the PROACT 200 system indicates a successful test of the backup pump by changing the backup pump status indicator from flashing amber to solid green. The test of the primary and backup pumps you have just seen are accomplished every seven days by the Beacon PROACT 200. The seven-segment display on the front panel is shown by means of the lighted segments when the next automatic test will take place. In this case, the three lighted segments show that three days have elapsed since the last automatic test and four days remain before the next automatic test.